I'm really excited today because it is a Tuesday, my favorite day of the week, and it is day five of fitness. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I hope you slept well. I hope you're doing just amazing. I am quite, quite excited. Like, I can't believe it is already five days into Fitmas. We have five more days to go and then it's a wrap. So far, honestly, it's been amazing. I'm really loving the responses for you guys. Thank you so much for joining me throughout this Fitmas mini holiday workout series. And today's workout is going to be a full body blast. You just want to break that amazing, amazing sweat and get the endorphins popping. So the moves are going to be a bit complicated, a bit complex. If you've had the previous days, then today will not be an issue. Trust me, okay? So today's workout is going to be a full body, total body tone-up. We're going to be targeting upper body to lower body, full body, some heat cardio here and there. So let's not talk too much and get right into the workout. I am training fasted and I'm quite hungry at the moment. My breakfast is waiting for me after the workout. <laughs> so let's get this done and dusted. Let's go. The first workout is going to be the alternating ankle taps doing four rounds of 26 taps with a 30 second rest in between each round. So you're literally counting from 1 to 26 as you are tapping onto your toes. If you can't reach your toes, at least try reach for your knees or your shin or your ankles. But the main aim here is to really activate your core and twist your obliques as you're reaching out to the other side of your leg once you're done with the 26 taps you're going to move to eight single leg taps so once you're done with eight on the right you're going to move to eight on the left but before you do that you're going to have to rest for 30 seconds before moving to the single leg taps and all that the 26 plus the eight is gonna count as one round and you have two more to go The second workout is going to be the oblique twists and you're going to do three rounds of 30 twists with a 30 second rest in between the rounds. You want to make sure that you are having your back as flat as possible. Do not arch your back. Do not put your butt in the air. Remain as straight and as flat as you can. The third workout is a high intensity cardio workout cell and it is a side step to the side kick doing 10 repetitions per leg for two rounds. So once you're done with 10 repetitions to the left, you're going to move to 10 repetitions to the right and you will be done for one round resting for 30 seconds before moving on to the second round, which you're going to repeat the same movement. Remember that you need to go as slow as possible. Do not pressure yourself too much. This one requires a lot of mind muscle connection. Just go at your own pace and get it done. For the fourth workout, you're going to get to the ground to perform the Renegade rows, doing three rounds of 12 rows for this movement with a 30 second rest in between the rounds. Keep in mind that you can ditch the dumbbells and just use your hands as shown and perform the exact same movement. Be slow and in control because this requires a lot of balance, but you can do it. The fifth workout is the high to low planks and here you're going to do 10 reps of 3 rounds with a 30 second rest in between the rounds. Take your time with this one, it's a bit confusing. It takes a lot of core work but you can do it. You're going to finish off with the low impact cardio, the side to side steps with the jabs, doing this for 60 seconds and resting for 30 seconds in between the three rounds. And after you're done with this, you're going to need to stretch and cool down because the workout will be complete. What? Hey, yo, 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 we need to take it slow, okay? I don't know if I'm glowing because you know like the highlight is popping or maybe it's just sweat. <laughs> anyway guys that was an amazing amazing workout. I'm feeling all warmed up, all 
toasted, yeah? I'm feeling amazing. And you see, one thing about such low impact meals is that they seem to be so simple, so easy, but once you actually get there and do them, hmm, 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 hmm. Anyway, guys, I would love to see you perform my fitness workout series on Instagram, on Twitter, Facebook. Mention me at AC Michelle and I'll be sure to repost you. Let them know that you are keeping fit during this festive season, okay? That you are killing it and you're not waiting for January 1st. You are doing really amazing. We have five more days to go of fit mass and tomorrow we're gonna be killing the lower belly, okay? It's gonna be all about the lower belly fat. We're gonna try and, you know, blast it. Do not forget to spread love and positive vibes and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.